I've been working with Gopal on the program through Rotary for quite a while uh, since its inception. You know, practice imaginary meals uh, uh, quite a few times at home and uh, with my wife. And uh, we try and imagine the taste and the feel of food and, and uh, what we're saving. And then, of course, they all you know, came to pass again today with our imaginary meal at Rotary, and it was, it was fantastic. We saved a lot of money that's going uh, to the needy within the community. And I'm glad that uh, I could be a part of it, along with all the other characters. We pretend that we're eating a hamburger and some fries, having some dessert, whatever we feel like that day. There's a bunch of different pictures of food available for us to choose from that day. So we have an imaginary lunch at work. And it's great. It helps with weight loss as well. I think it's fascinating. At first, it was a hard concept for me to grasp, but after Bill Paul's talk about how for each meal that we could save money, we could be donating that money to very hungry people in our community. Um, I think it's an excellent idea. It's just not very hard for us to skip a meal or two to help out. By doing these imaginary meals, one, you get a better understanding of, of what people in need go through every day. And two, um, you can raise money um, to help them out. And a lot of that proceeds goes directly to the homeless shelters. Uh, some of it goes to Bag of Light, which is uh, the other program that provides nutrition meals to people in need. And so it's a wonderful cause. Um, Balls informed everybody that there's a lot of people that are, are in need of food. About 20% of the people in Placer County really go hungry every day. And so if we can help in some small way, we're very happy to do that. To think about children that are going to school with empty tummies. To think about, to think about kids that are having a hard time um, studying. Parents that are having a hard time focusing at work or having the energy with which to, to achieve what they want to, to get to that next step. It was, it was a neat experience to, to take that time and remind ourselves, remind myself, that this is an issue here in this community and, and awareness needs to be raised.